What's going on, everyone? This is Richard from Nothing But Nostalgia, back again with another one for the last and final video for 007 Nightfire. This is Equinox. James, I'm still patched into Drake's comm system. I've intercepted enough radio chatter to learn that Drake's combat troops have overtaken the defense platform. Some of the original crew might still be alive, but I can't confirm that. I can tell you that Drake's deployed a laser defense net, which draws power from the platform's core. Rather enjoyed your company, James. Do be careful. Call out. Tight, so... Your boy's in space. <laughs> I'm excited. I've never played this map. I am stoked. You're on a fool's errand, Mr. Bond. I've just locked the launch sequence. Nothing can stop Operation Nightfire. Not even my own death. That's, That's what they all say. I mean to test. <laughs> You've already failed miserably. But tinker with my missiles if you must. To make a splendid target for my laser cannons. James, the missiles. You won't be able to disarm the warheads in time. Your only hope is to sabotage the launch system in some way. You'll have to disable them manually. Each launch gantry has a weak coupling that you can melt with your laser. I'll credit you with persistence, Mr. Bond. Persistence and failure. Um, there are little large sites on Earth which could oh. challenge the arsenal on my island. Those bases will be incinerated. By turning these defensive missiles into massively offensive ones. I've kept my most hardened combat veterans on reserve, Bond. I'll let them finish you off. Well, it says he's a laser. Oh, people, fucking people in space. <laughs> there you go. Oh. That's Remember that view, Mr. Bond. It's the last you'll ever see on Earth. Um. James, the missile launch couplings are exposed. If you lay today, you should be able to move the missiles. That one good? Yeah, just the one I guess. You've done it, James! You saw it out of control! Operation Nightfire can't be stopped. Soon you will look your card on the table. Be mine. I guess we should be shooting here. There are okay. far more too bad. Seconds on the clock. Just gotta worry about these little fuckers up here. Uh, where? Where's this guy at? It can't adjust its course, James. You've done it. Side, there it Mr. Is. Bond. I'm going to make the Earth a much better place. Controlling the space station, I'll rewrite the balance of power. Imagine one cool. Oh, God damn it. Where are these guys guys? How annoying. A lot of them. What the hell? I could use a man of your resources. Why not join him? Okay, so that's power good. Approaching overload. Now we gotta get this one. James, if that power core goes, the whole base will become unstable. Cool. Especially with Drake firing that laser. Well, I don't have any body armor. Sorry, I'm like kind of quiet on this one too. This is actually, it's pretty easy. It's a little it's challenging. It's just these little fuckers just kind of just jump like all directions. Come on. Radiation levels critical. It's futile, Mr. Bond. Open up. Okay, so that one's good, so we gotta get the back to you real quick. I'm gonna be great just watching. Cool. Last one. Cool. Done. Now where are these guys at? Oh, they're all over the place. Fuck off, dude. You may have Whoa. stopped the fire this time, Bond. But like the Phoenix, I'll rise from the ashes. What does that mean? The missiles are 
damaging the station. It's starting to break up. James, you must hurry. What am I doing? The laser has gone into overload, James. Drake's lost control of it. It could blow any second. Just back up. What's going on? Don't know what's going on, guys. Yeah, that's really it. What? Uh... I am lost. Okay, I have no idea what just happened right now. Of course, you got stuff to the very beginning again. I'll credit you with persistence, Mr. Bond. Persistence and failure. There are NATO launch sites on Earth which could challenge the arsenal on my island. Those bases will be incinerated. So now I kind of know what to by do. Now I just gotta to do it again. Massively offensive ones. I've kept my most hardened combat veterans on reserve, Bond. I'll let them finish you off. Oh, so that'd be kind of cool if I could just go in there. Remember that you missed, Bond. Overcharge. It's the last you'll ever see of Earth. Ah. Oh. James, the missile launch couplings are exposed. If you later, then you should be able to ripple the missiles. Perfect. Get out of here. You've done it, James. Oh, come on. The missile went out of control. Operation Nightfire can't be stopped. Soon the only nuclear guard on the table will be mine. There are Ooh. far more missiles to disarm than seconds on the clock. Okay, this one coming up right here. It can't adjust its course, James. You've done it. You're on the wrong side, Mr. Bond. I'm going to make the Earth a much better place. Controlling the space station. I'll be like, like, this mission is hard. These guys are definitely, uh, really annoying, though. Well done, James. You continue to impress me, Bond. I could use a man of your resources. Go. And then at the end, where everything is all good to go, like I have no idea what's even. I'm not too sure which I'm supposed to go. This one. It's futile, Mr. Bond. Cool. How would you like to die? Slowly from a ruptured oxygen line or a swift burn through the Earth's atmosphere. I like how it looks like he's like the motion of the character looks like he's walking over actually in space. Just floating by, no big deal. Okay, well done. So now what do I do? See, I'm so lost. I have no idea what to do. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. I guess they're ten to charm. Sorry, guys. Persistence and failure. There are NATO launch sites on Earth which could challenge the arsenal on my island. Those bases will be incinerated by turning these defensive missiles into massively offensive ones. I've kept my most hardened combat veterans on reserve, Bond. 
So sorry guys. I have no idea where to even go about this mission after this. James, the missile launch company's been spawned. If you later then you should be able to cripple the missiles. Get the little fuckheads out of here. You've done it, James! Oh. The missile went out of control. Operation Nightfire can't be stopped. Soon the only nuclear card on the table will be mine. Going to get this couplet. It can't adjust its course, James. You've done it. You're on the wrong side, Mr. Bond. I'm going to make the Earth a much better place. Control the space station. I'll rewrite the balance of power. Imagine the Let's do it here. Well done, James. But what the fuck do I do after I defeat this part? Good work, James. The missile flew off course. Only three remaining. That missile went off course and the station. The power is destroying anyway. Power is critical. You guys are out of the picture now. Destroy this. Okay, so this is done. Now, how the fuck do I defeat this guy? Stand back and watch. You may have stopped the fire this time, Bond. When I the Phoenix, I'll rise from the ashes. So I see I saw him run. Did I just fucking kill him? I did. Oh, I fucking did it. What a weird mission. This game is fucking weird. I mean, I can honestly say that this game is still probably one of my favorites just due to the multiplayer aspect, but what a weird campaign, to be honest with you. And you do have to get used to these controls. These controls are very wonky. Shaken, not stirred. Or is it stirred, not shaken? Oh. Hello. Definitely stirred. Astronomers from around the globe are reporting unexpected meteor showers. Well done, 007. Then I'm sure the world won't mind my taking a few days off. We'll let the autopilot be our designated driver. Oh, wow. James. Then I think that's it. Hey, at least I got a bronze medal on this one. James Bond. Oh.
Working for over 20 months, the team at EA Games developed James Bond 007 Nightfire. Three core international teams in the United States, England and Canada, programmers, writers, artists, designers and animators, collaborated to create an unparalleled James Bond experience. Adding to the fantasy, Agent 007 looks and feels just like the film star himself, Pierce Brosnan. Thanks in part to a laser scanning process that captured the features of his face, using over a quarter of a million data points, Brosnan's persona as 007 brings the Bond film star into the hands of game players. That's pretty neat. We see Pierce Brosnan in the game. You see Pierce Brosnan. He's the epitome of James Bond. Uh, to be honest with you, I'm just going to skip this because if you guys really wanted to see it, I know you can definitely find it online. These are all the credits. Can I pass this? I don't think I can. But again, I really do appreciate you guys tuning in. Um, we just beat 007 Nightfire from 2002. Um, if I were to give this a nothing but nostalgia rating, I'd probably say uh, 7 out of 10. Um, definitely a fun game. Don't get me wrong. The campaign is definitely not a strong suit. But if I would vouch for this game, it would definitely have to be because of the multiplayer. Um, but other than that, guys, I mean, I do appreciate you guys tuning in. And seeing what's up. Till next time when we play our new game. Peace.